Rain clouds have been dropping heavy to moderate showers to southern coastal regions and Jeju Island from yesterday. So up to 60 millimeters of additional rain is in store for the southern coastal areas, while Jeju will see 30 to 80 millimeters of showers throughout the day. And it could be accompanied by thunder and lightning. But it's looking sunny and bright here in Seoul. In fact, upper parts of the nation will see sun throughout the day with warm highs, but it will be a cool day for regions down south, so let's take a closer look. The afternoon high in the Seoul will rise to 30, but daytime high in Daegu and Gwangju will rise to 27 and 26, while Busan will top out at 25 later on. Now for other regions, it looks like Jeju Island will hike up to 24, while Tokdo will rise to 22 later in the day. Now the weather outlook for the next three days here in Seoul is looking okay, though uh, there is a chance of sporadic showers on Friday in the afternoon hours, but other than that, it's looking sunny and bright until the end of the weekend. Well, that's all for Korea, and here's the international weather for viewers around the world.